Hi. Now, in this example, we've got to differentiate with respect to x, y equals x cubed, multiplied by the natural log of 2x. So if you'd like to give this a go, if you haven't done so already, I'll give you a moment to pause the video. OK, welcome back if you had a go. Now, what I'm going to do in this one is just differentiate it as if I was doing it straight off. If you don't uh, understand what I've done, towards the end of the video I'll redo it again in a lot slower stages. So this stage will only take a few moments to do. What I'm going to do is use the product rule for differentiation, which is I take one part, that's say the x cubed, and I multiply it by the differential of the other part, the natural log of 2x. And I have to use the chain rule for this, and if I differentiate this, I let the 2x be t, and I've got the differential of natural log of t, which is 1 over t, 1 over 2x in this case. And then I multiply it by the differential of what I call t, and that is the differential of 2x, which is 2. I will go over this in a few moments, OK? And then plus, and then I do it the other way around. I take natural log of 2x, and I multiply this by the differential of x cubed, which is 3x squared. And if I tidy this up, I notice that these two twos cancel one another out, and the x here cancels into the x cubed, goes x squared times. So we actually end up with x squared plus 3x squared, I'll put that at the front here, 3x squared, natural log of 2x. So that's how I would normally do it. Now if you want this broken down in slower steps, then what I'll do here is to show you how we go about it. First of all, what we have here is two functions of x being multiplied together. So we use what is called the product rule for differentiation. And you should be familiar with this rule. It is essentially that if you've got y equals two functions of x, which we'll call u and v, then it can be shown that dy by dx equals, say, u multiplied by the dv by dx plus v times du by dx. Now in this example, what I did was I picked u as being, or we'll just say let here, I picked u as being the x cubed, and I picked v as being the natural log of 2x. So I needed to differentiate each of these at some point. So when it came to differentiating x cubed, that was du by dx. This one is just simply 3x squared. When it comes to on to differentiating the natural log of 2x, though, I need to use what is called the chain rule. We'll just mark it in here, chain rule. Now, to differentiate using the chain rule, you should be familiar with this rule, and that is that dy by dx is always equal to dy by d something multiplied by the same d something by dx. And I'm going to choose dt here to be that d something. So what we do is we let, we let y equal the natural log of 2x. And we let t, we'll just say where t equals the 2x. So essentially what we've got is that therefore y equals the natural log. Instead of 2x, it's going to be the natural log of t. So when it comes to differentiating with respect to x, the natural log of t, what we do is we do dy by dt first of all, and if you differentiate the natural log of t with respect to t, it's 1 over t. So you get 1 over t, and then you have to multiply it by dt by dx. And if you differentiate t with respect to x, you get 2. So what I've got here is 1 over t times 2. Well, 1 over t is 1 over 2x 
t being 2x and then we multiply it by the 2. So when it came to differentiating doing dv by dx we can see that differentiating natural log of 2x is essentially 1 over 2x multiplied by 2. Now I know this reduces down to just simply 1 over x but going back to the steps that I did here hopefully you can put this together here because I picked up on the product rule I took one part I took the x cubed just wrote it down and I multiplied it by the differential of the other part natural log of 2x and I used the chain rule I said let t be the 2x so differentiating natural log of t is 1 over t so that's 1 over 2x multiplied by the differential of what I called t so that was the 2 that part there is this part then it's plus and then I do it the other way around I take this part natural log of 2x according to what we've got here and then I multiply it by the differential of the first part 3x squared okay so there's my product rule in here and here we've got the chain rule then for the differential national for the differential of the natural log of 2x